Hello, I'm Francis Hadford, the Deputy Chief Constable here in Thames Valley. Last night we had some isolated uh, pockets of uh, disorder across the Thames Valley area. Most of it were relatively small numbers of youths who were caught running around causing some antisocial behaviour, but we did have some damage uh, caused in different parts. What's really good though is that officers got there very quickly and arrests were made, and I can tell you as well that arrests, further arrests will follow. Um, and we will be dealing with those pe people in a very positive way. I'm very grateful for the information that has come in for, from people across Thames Valley. Um, the, the, the information has really helped us to, to be able to get on top of these incidents very quickly and I know that the support that we're getting from a lot of people across the Thames Valley has been resounding. Um, this sort of behaviour is not tolerated either by the police or by the, the vast majority of the community. Um, and that positive and, uh, approach and robust approach will continue over the next few days. Clearly, if you've got further information, then please do pass it on to us. Um, and I would, I would encourage people to look at our Twitter feeds if they want information about what is actually happening. There are still a lot of rumours that are incorrect about uh, incidents happening. In terms of what you'll see this evening, you'll continue to see uh, considerable numbers of officers out uh, on our streets providing reassurance, but also making sure that if uh, we do see groups gathering and potentially causing problems, then they will be nipped in the bud very, very quickly. So you will see increased numbers of police officers, of special constables and also PCSOs, but also some of our partners, our wardens, neighbourhood wardens and other, other people across Thames Valley will be, be out on our streets. Please do speak to them and if you've got information then, then pass that on to them as well.